Hello and good morning YouTube. Um, today is Sunday. Um, on a normal Sunday I would have actually gone to church but because they're closed I'm at home today and I'm in the kitchen right now and I'm about to make um, breakfast. I'm going to be having banana pancakes so I'm just going to show you how I make them. I'm actually watching this new series it's actually a korean drama it's called love featuring marriage and divorce if you know anything about korean dramas then you know what i'm talking about korean dramas are just so addictive there was like a phase that i was going through where i was watching a bunch of korean dramas back to back back to back and now i feel like i've entered that phase again anyways um yeah they're just really interesting so i'm gonna just sit down and eat and watch some netflix Okay guys, so quick recap since I didn't really film much this afternoon. Anyway, so I I went and filmed the video and the video took quite a long time to film because I was really struggling with the lighting and I was struggling with the background so there was a lot happening at the time and then I had a headache and then I went to go take a nap. So fast forward, I'm sitting at my study table, it's about to be 10pm, it's quarter to 10 and um, second semester starts tomorrow. So I'm trying to quickly put my life together, quickly organize some things so that I'm ready for the um, new semester and I'm ready for the week and whatnot. So let me just quickly show you what my timetable for this week looks like. Okay, so here we're looking at my timetable for the next four weeks. Just to give a quick explanation, we're going to have what we call preclinicals for four weeks. And that is just theory lectures covering three um, blocks of the second semester. The three blocks that we're going to be covering is cardiopulmonary, which you can see here. We also have NMS and we also have orthopedics. I'm going to be doing cardiopulmonary for the first one and a half weeks. And then we're going to switch to NMS and then we're going to switch to orthopedics for the rest of the four weeks so to show you what's going to happen the first week tomorrow is monday so basically tomorrow i have my orientation to to the cardiopulmonary block at half past eight in the morning and then here i have another lecture and pretty much another lecture so the whole day is going to be a bunch of lectures and it's going to be online monday and tuesday i'm online wednesday i'm supposed to be on campus wednesday and thursday because there's a venue here. I'm supposed to be on campus and then Friday is supposed to be online. Because it is lockdown, I'm not really sure how they're going to do things. If I'm actually going to go on Wednesday or Thursday. But we'll see how it goes. One thing to quickly mention is that once I finish my four weeks of preclinical theory lectures, then after that we start our three blocks of actual clinical placements where I'll be going to hospital and whatnot. So this is just a timetable for the next four weeks. So we did some exercises today and they were yo they were really tiring. So the plan was to actually do three sets and we only managed to do like one and a half two rounds. We did two rounds. Mm. We did two rounds of exercises. I mean I, I haven't exercised in months to be honest. I haven't exercised in months. Mm. The sun is coming out. Like jumping lunges, jumping squats, burpees. We did snatch and then we did dumbbell swings. So it was a nice high intensity and also we're gonna finish off with some sprints. Three sets. I don't know about sprints, sorry. You're gonna I'm sprint. Sprinting. We're gonna do three sets of three sprints, and yeah, it's nice to get out 
and to just move your body every once in a while. So yeah. Yep. Good afternoon, so it is Wednesday, it is 4pm right now and I just finished a really really long um, lecture. I'm in my cardiopulmonary block now. So the lecture um, for today was exercise and chronic diseases and basically we're talking about um, exercise and um, the impacts of exercise in chronic conditions like hypertension, like diabetes and obesity as well as different types of drugs and medications and their impacts um, in terms of physiotherapy treatment for the patient. And earlier today, I think about 12 o'clock, I had a Q&A session which was also online and um, it was just based on the lectures that I had covered earlier today. I always find Q&A sessions really helpful because even if I don't have questions myself, there will always be somebody who has a question and I might even find some clarity on some of the things I thought I understood and may not have understood. So yeah, so I'm all done with all my online lectures for today. Um, if I don't talk to you guys later today, then I'll probably talk to you again tomorrow. I was actually expecting um, a delivery that I made from Take A Lot to arrive tomorrow, but they just sent me an email today telling me that um, it has to be delayed because one of the items couldn't be um, delivered by tomorrow. So unfortunately, that's not going to come tomorrow. But um, if not, then I will just film that when it arrives on Friday. So I'll see you guys whenever I pick up the camera again, pretty much. My delivery is here. So I know exactly what's inside. It's actually my first time ordering from Take A Lot. So I was sitting there thinking like, what if my package doesn't arrive? Because so whole time. The first thing I got was a tripod. I got it for my camera that I'm using now. Let me just open it and let's see what it looks like. Hmm, interesting. It's a bit small. Is it smaller than the other one I've seen? Okay, it looks quite decent actually. It feels sturdy. Here we go. Tripod sorted. I'm gonna bring you guys those vlogs. So it was it was 97 rand, and then it came with the adapter to connect your phone. And next, I got a laptop stand. And the reason I got this was because I've been doing a lot of sitting at my laptop and sitting at my table. And whenever I sit there, like my neck gets really painful because I have to bend my head to look at my laptop. So I was like, okay, I need a solution to bring my laptop high and ooh. This feels heavy. This feels so heavy duty. Look at it. So you push your laptop on and I'm gonna insert a clip of me actually putting my laptop on so you can see, you guys can see what it looks like. Okay, I'm, I'm not sure how this works. Um <laughs> a few moments later. Okay, wait. I think yeah, 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 yeah. And then you put it like that, and then your laptop will sit on the front. I will show you the clip so you so it all makes sense when you see the clip. This feels proper. This was um, this was how much was this? This was 188. So I saw other ones that were like 250, 300, and I thought they probably I don't know. I I, I was going initially going to buy one for 250, and then I saw one that was 188, and I'm just like, you know what? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. These things all look the same. So I got a foundation. So I got this uh, Maybelline Fit Me foundation. The reason I got this was because um, you know, I want to start getting into makeup and that kind of thing. Well, not really into makeup per se. I want to do like natural makeup looks. If you guys see when people do those makeup, no makeup, makeup looks, that's exactly what I want to do. But I know nothing about makeup. I Googled to try to find out what's the best thing for a beginner. Actually, everything Everybody was saying Maybelline Fit Me um, is the best thing to use. It's really quite affordable. This was 86 rand on take a lot and then at clicks they were selling it for like 112, 115 rand and I was like no baby, 86 rand it is. And this is the pecan, pecan shade. I didn't test my shade. I actually got, I actually went to the shops, I went to clicks the other day and then I wanted to test but then they were like no we don't have any testers because of lockdown. I had to go and try and guess my shade so hopefully this works out. So I got um a beauty blender okay 
I hope you can see that. Oh, it's really cute. And the color is so pretty. And it's quite soft. Yeah, so it's very, very soft. Um, let me put on the foundation because I want to see if it matches. Why does it look a bit watery? Is it supposed to look like that? This is, this is the shade and it looks pretty, it looks pretty good. Okay, now that we're up close and personal, let me try it on and see if it matches well. This is dark. It looks so dark on the beauty blender. Why is nothing coming out of my face? Did this thing just suck up all the foundation? I think this beauty blender just suck up, sucked up all the foundation I put. But the shade, the shade looks like, I'm so impressed. I think I got the perfect shade. And I didn't even know what my shade was. And this looks like the perfect shade. What do you think? Does this, do you think this looks like my shade? This looks really nice. Let me put some more here. Obviously, I'm not doing the whole makeup routine. I'm just shaking the, the color. So I, I know that, you know, obviously you do a whole routine. You put your primer, what's what, what. I'm just trying to check if the shade is my shade. And I think it is. You literally can't even see where my skin ends and where the foundation ends and that's exactly what I was looking for I didn't want it to look like I was wearing foundation I really like it I really like it um, so that's pretty much what I got um, the, just to mention the beauty blender was um, 50 rand I don't think I mentioned that anyway so that's the mini haul over and done with I'm pretty happy with everything that I got I'm happy that the quality that I expected is actually what was delivered. And um, yeah, looking forward to further purchases in the future. Thank you for watching my video. If you haven't liked this video, please to give it a like. Please subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And also please remember to turn on your post notifications so that you get notified whenever I post a video. Um, thank you to everybody who has already subscribed. Thank you to you guys for liking all of my videos. I see you. I notice you and I'm super super grateful for that and guys on to the next video bye